better way to kick off the first day of summer than to update your closet with the latest fashion trends for this coming summer. If you need inspiration, my guest Kyra Lastly can help you get your wardrobe and accessories updated for this long, hot season. Kyra, thank you for joining us today. Now tell us about your jewelry. How long have you been doing this? Well, I've been making um, accessories my entire life, whether it's changing a necklace into earrings, a belt into a necklace, earrings into rings, paper clips, whatever I could get my hands on, I was always changing or transforming something in some sort of way. So much so that my friends would always say they would know whenever I'm coming because I would be like jingling because I would have so many accessories on. So for me, it's just been a natural evolution of what I've been doing my entire life. So you would say that you're a creative person? I think so. <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay. So tell me about Coco Dolls. Is that just specifically your jewelry or is it something more than just making jewelry? Coco Dolls is definitely a brand that I've started recently. Um, in March of this year, I actually got my tax ID number, LLC, all of that great stuff. Wow. Yeah. So um, it's going to be all encompassing. It's going to be, you know, styling personal like evolution of just beauty whatever it is so I've definitely started with jewelry I started the entire brand on my own no money no investors um, I literally went to Michael's one day I was like hey I just want to buy up as much stuff as possible wow. see what I can come up with so jewelry is definitely the first step in that but I would definitely like to expand it into you know um, styling and other clothing design do you sew well, I do, <laughs> but uh, I'm not a perfectionist yet. I would definitely like to um, bring designers onto the Coco Doll scene to do, you know, the designing and things like that. So where does your inspiration come for jewelry making? Mainly just from street. Whatever, you know, is hot on the streets is exactly what I want to make. You know, everyone that I uh, cater to is definitely um, a young person mm -hmm. <laughs> and so you know we want whatever is hot we want the newest trendiest things a lot of it is Im imagination like I might see a belt and be like oh my god that would be a great earring so I try to either replicate it or get the actual piece to try to you know manipulate it and see how I can work with those types of you know pieces so you have a very important event coming up. I do, the I do. The Coco Dolls yeah. Trunk Show. Tell us about the trunk show. I am so excited. This is my first event that I've ever um, um, been coordinating or, you know, been over. Um, so for me, it's like my baby. Like, you know, I love fashion. I love anything fabulous. I'm just really excited to be able to put it all together. Um, during this event, I'm going to have several different young entrepreneurs, other okay. vendors that are going to be there showcasing, whether it's their service or a product that they've actually made themselves. They're going to have the opportunity to be able to put, put it out into the community. And then also we're going to have a fashion show, which is the trunk show part of it. Oh, wow. So there will be designers such as Tiki. She's a fashion designer. She does all the sewing herself. There will also be a stylist by the name of Whitney. She's going to show her um, collection. And then I'm also going to show my vintage collection as well as all the jewelry. Yeah. So it's going to be like just a fabulous, phenomenal event. I cannot wait. Oh, that is going to be so fun. Yeah. I'm excited. I'm excited. So where do you see Coco Dolls in the next, I don't even want to say five to ten years. I want to say like next year, like this time next year. I would really like to be in as many retail stores that I think fit my brand um, in Oklahoma City, in Tulsa, in Lawton. I just want to really, you know, go into major stores just in cities in Oklahoma. I would also like to expand to Dallas and to um, Houston. So with some of the upcoming meetings that I have, that those have been the plans that we're putting into to progress. Okay. Now I heard through the grapevine uh -huh. Facebook, uh -huh. you have a very special like jewelry buyer. Is it true that Wanda <laughs> Pratt, the mother of superstar Kevin Durant, she wears your jewelry? Yes, she does. Yes, she does. I love her. She has such an amazing spirit. I'm um, just standing and talking to her. You know that she's smart. She's strong. She has her head on her shoulders. You know, she's just an inspirational woman, period. Mm -hmm. So for her to, you know, seek out my jewelry and be like, I want this one, this one, this one, this one. And then I want you to do a custom piece. It's like, wow, really? So wow. I go from, you know, making necklaces and earrings to like people actually, um, 
liking the, the things that I make. And so that for me is a huge accomplishment. Plus I'm a huge Thunder fan. So why would I not, you know, just be in awe that she even, you know, sought out my jewelry. Definitely. I'm yeah. super jealous. So how can other people besides Miss Pratt get a hold of you to get some of this cool collective jewelry? Um, it's really easy. If you have Facebook, then you can definitely tap into me. Um, Coco Dolls, K-O-K-O. D-O-L-L-S is available on Facebook. That is the major outlet that I have. You don't have to go to another site. You can stay on the site that you're always already using, whether it's on your laptop, your cell phone. I mean, how often are you checking your Facebook? Mm. All the time, right? Mm -hmm. So it's very simple. You just um, can add my page on Facebook and then just do orders straight through Facebook. You don't have to go anywhere else. Wow. Yeah. You all heard it first. Coco Dolls, <laughs> Facebook. K-O-K-O -K -O yes. dolls. <laughs> well, thank you, Kyra, for coming to join me in the studio. I love all this jewelry. Thank you so much it's, for having me. I want some. I'm thinking about writing Girl, a check I have now. Some for you. Yes, <laughs> thank you so much for everything. Anytime, anytime. And for News 24-7, visit www.newsok.com.